It's always a special time to have alumni back on campus. And this week, we are extremely excited to have one of our most successful alumni with us. Phil Sims is hosting the Complete Skills Camp with Moorhead State Football. He is excited to be here with over 50 campers from across the United States, celebrating his history and legacy at Moorhead and passing that on to future potential Eagles here at his alma mater. Yeah, I like running camps. I mean, I probably am on the field with kids three to four days a week easy. You know, I really enjoy doing it, and I think it's something I'm really good at, and that's that when you're good at something, you want to do it all the time, and that's why I like going to these camps. All right, let's do a five-step drop really slow under the center, hitch, step, turn, and throw, okay? It's nothing like uh, teaching somebody to do something, they do it, they turn around and look at you and smile. I mean, it's awesome because it feels good and it makes me feel good too. This is an instruction camp. This is not a, a you know, a one day camp where you come in and you're going to run the 40 and you're going to test your, your skills. You're going to, you're going to have 12 hours of instruction. We're going to watch film. We're going to, we're going to, we're going to really work on their, on their uh, technique and, and hopefully help them become better football players. Of course, football is a great drawing thing for me. Uh, every head coach that comes through here, I like to, you know, show my support for them and, um, uh, and you know, to come back and do some camps uh, for the football team, the football program, and, and just friends. So uh, I really enjoy that. Of course, I love going on the field, especially at this age, teaching quarterbacks and receivers, whoever. Uh, so to come here and get to do that, it's just, it's awesome. Phil is not only a proud Eagle alum, He's real, he's genuine. He is meeting and greeting with each one of these young athletes on a personal level. He spends countless hours with young athletes and he is invested in each and every one of them. You know, I started back in 2012 and 13 and, and uh, just wanted that, uh, that presence in our program and uh, worked real hard at developing a relationship with Phil and gosh, we talk, talk as much as, as my brother and I talk, you know, so. Uh, it's a good relationship, it's uh, someone I can lean on outside of our uh, department and university sometimes and, and uh, you know he's been around a lot of impressive people, coaches, administrators, leaders, CEOs um, and he's so, uh, he's so professional in everything that he does but he's real and uh, not only uh, an alumnus of here but, but a real good friend too. And I think of the fact that you know not to be self-serving here, but if I wouldn't have come here, would I be where I am now? Would I have had a chance to play in the NFL like I did, you know, to come here and start for four years? You know, it just it did everything for me. So I always think about it. Uh, the friends I made here, I still keep in touch with all those friends to this day. And here we all, all in our mid-60s or whatever. And we can't believe the time has passed, but we're all going to get together when this camp is over just because it's here and it was a great place to make friends.